Are you flipping stupid, bro? No, these flies are getting a bit crafty. <laughs> They're getting a bit crafty. I'm have to find a smarter way to take them out, bro. Trespassing gets shot, bro. If you get me, like them man are intruders in my home, bro. You you better believe that man give man the slipper treatment. I'm not really the guy with the belt, so I use the slipper. I have to treat you like you're my son. Slap man with the slipper, bro. But the difference is you're not making it out. My son will survive, but you're you're dead, bro. I ain't gonna lie. So I treat these pussy hoes, bro. I'm not gonna lie, man. Try creep up on me, man. Almost got the backhand from hell, rude boy. But nah, listen, we got a couple gems. Man like Johan Lapen and man like Krabba literally just messaged me at two a.m. about this one, you know. So you know he's important, bro. Let's get straight into it. Um, he's nineteen and he's French, and his name is Johan Lapen, bro. Obviously, man's for now. He he he's he's probably. In an elite team holding bench, but if you're not an elite team, you can walk straight in, let's be honest. The only thing he's missing right now for his age is composure. But then again, for his age, I think he's performing quite well. Um one of the one of those midfielders that gets they get busy still. Man man's tackling all the time, bro. Like this guy, he's a, he's a warrior still. Learned from what what's that guy's name? I was about to say Ratatouille, Master Splinter. Then man there. All right, next we've got Miguel Gutierrez, bro, if you get me. Um, this guy yeah, is a forward-thinking left-back, and that's literally it, I'll be honest. Um, in terms of going forward, I believe he's going to be elite in the future. Right now, 15 dribbling and 14 crossing, 12 flair, and he's got that 13 off the ball as well. This guy's quality, man. I ain't going to lie. Like, I appreciate his, his ability still. So, yeah, he's, he's a forward-thinking guy. The reason why I haven't mentioned the defensive side is because I don't want to because I think it just ruins everything. Because if I get into the fact that he's he's not going to be there, first of all, like, above everything, most importantly, he's just not going to be there, bro. Like, 11 positioning, the guy's gone, let's be honest. And then the, the 10 composure as well, mix of the 12 tackling, he looks like a headache defensively. So we'll probably keep that complete wing back. And with that, we can um, hopefully have some backup on cover Centre backs put put them on cover, give him extra defensive support because he's going to need it, bro. I ain't gonna lie. All right, the next one we've got is oh wow, all right, Dadu Jun Jundo. What the flip? I right, crab. I'm not gonna lie. This guy is absolutely. I mean, oh uh, yeah, he's 19. He's actually really heavily priced, and I'm thinking, how, bro? We can't even. First of all, we can't control the ball. Uh, most importantly, he can't even see the ball. So I'm thinking, what is he actually going to be useful for, bro? Like, he's terrible composure-wise. He's just a physical specimen, bro. I ain't going to lie. This guy should be playing anything else but football, bro. Because yeah, I don't think he's a footballer. Stat-wise, this isn't a footballer, bro. He should be an Olympian in line with Usain Bolt and Tyson Gee. Them man there, bro. I ain't going to lie, bro. It's peak, bro. Alright, next we've got man like Omar Campos, yeah. Um, this guy's 20 and I'm looking at the stats. Krabba, I'll be honest, yeah. See this guy right here, I think he'll cost me too much money. Like, honestly, not only the wages, because man's paying that out of my own pocket, but man's saying that I would have to get a ball boy as well, bro. I'm going to have to pay a ball boy if we're playing this guy, because the, the ball's going to keep on leaving the stadium. Man, have to get a couple ball boys to be chasing that down, bruv. You get me, man's got eight first touch. This is scary because now the, everyone that's driving is at risk because the ball's going to be bouncing all up in the road, causing bare accidents, bruv. Man on bike's going to be swerving around the ball, trying to avoid the ball. And now they're going to have to be swerving around the ball and cars. It's just not ideal. Too much money, bro. All right, next we've got uh 18-year-old called Augustin Gay. All right, um, nice name, bruv, you get me. Physically... He's, he's all right in terms of movement. Obviously, the strength is a myth. Man's got nine strength. The guy's getting... He's just getting removed from the ball. That's all I can say. Like, anyone that's got a bit of physicalness about them, if that's a word, yeah, just going to remove him from the ball very easily as well. However, going forward, if he decides to get a bit crafty, he wants to cross it early or something, he's got, he's got that in his locker still. 
I ain't gonna lie, bro. Man can definitely cross that early, bro. 15 crossing, I appreciate it, bro. And then 40, 10, 8, version and 13 passing, I believe he's a very creative and crafty right back that can catch man slipping, rude boy. Yeah, so you better watch out. Man can catch you slipping on the counter attack. Whip that ball. Whip, whip, whip that ball. Whip that ball. And then, yeah, tackling wise, he's, he's great. I ain't gonna lie, bro. Tackling wise, 13 for an 18 year old, I'll take that all day every day and yeah um, couple holes in the mental section positioning wise it is mythical like yeah i'll be honest that's terrible bro so um that's a forward thinking player right there but at least we've got him on wing back meaning that we would have a lot of extra defensive support in in order to use this guy all right next we've got desire do yeah if i've put this guy in any of my gem videos before please let me know because he looks too good for me to have never used him in any of my videos. There's no way he hasn't made an appearance yet because that's crazy. But nah, shout out Krabber. This guy's this guy's quality, bro. You man, you're lucky to be in the presence of such brilliance right now. And I'm happy to be the one that's showing you about him, hopefully. And um, I really hope that you haven't seen any of these guys before. And yeah, nah, he can do pretty much everything that I want, bro. Yeah, man. Well, nah, apart from shoot at a high level he, he's useless at that but creating wise the 14 technique version and 14 passing for a 17 year old he's up there with some of the coldest bro so yeah he's quality man even got some of the physicals as well mentally he's he's doing well but we just need a little bit more but he's only 17 so how can i get mad bro you better watch out guys he's 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 quality man all right um we got william bovin next He's very fast, got decent dribbling ability. He can actually control the ball as well. Gets into the right positions, good composure, and he can pass very well with the 40, 13 technique, 13 vision, and 13 passing as well, bro. Um, the problem with this guy is what I always say, what separates the elite players to the guys that are like chilling with the farmers and the barbers is the decision-making. And I know it's one step, and I know I've made a video that kind of counters that, but I don't give a damn, I'll stick by everything that I said before. Um, decision making is important, he's got 11 right now, he's only 19, but um, we need to definitely sort that out, bro, I'll be honest. But no, nah, he's doing well. I see I see a bit of potential in this guy still. Oh, my days. All right, man, like Juan Luca Pestiani, one of the best gems today, in my opinion, bro. The guy's only 16. And yeah, look at the stats, bro. The guy looks like he's already paying his own taxes, bruv. Man's only 16, 5 foot 5. It makes sense. That's how it should be, bro. You get me? But um, the agility. That guy, I just watched the Mario movie. This guy's mini Mario, bro. That that small mushroom, boy, boy, boy. That blue mushroom. Man keeps on indulging in those mini man. Yeah, dribbling and flair. It's amazing, bro. Look at him. Man, his, his, cent his center of gravity is so low. I feel sorry for the guys that are um, a tall height because you can't keep up with this guy, bro. Um, and yeah, he can create. He looks like a creative player. Got a lot of depth in terms of positioning. And he's he's great, bro. For a 16-year-old, he's going far. He's going places, bro. I respect his thing still. And lastly, we've got man like Delane Bakwa, bro. I'll be honest, this guy will cost me too much money to even put him in my team, bro. Let me explain, yeah. So the other guy, man, would have to get ball boys because he can't control that ball. So man, have to get ball boys to duck that, duck that ball down, yeah. This guy, I need to be in line with NASA and then man in space for the way he's going to be finishing that ball, bro. So he's going to get into the greater positions. He's going to... Bro, the guy can put himself in the best position out of nothing with the 15 dribbling and the 17 flair at 19 years old mixed with a pace. The guy will put himself in amazing predicaments, but when it's time to shoot, lock it off, bro. I'll be honest, turn off the screen. Turn off the laptop, turn off the TV, whatever you're doing, whatever you're using, switch it off, bro. I'll be honest, there's no point of you trying to watch seven finishing and six long shots. It's a myth, bro, I'll be honest. So if we put him on a supporting role, then you have to highlight the lack of decisions. So yeah, this is a problem, and I think it's a it's a it's a financial problem too. Man, need to man, man, man have to get get involved in the outer space world, bro. Chilling with them aliens over there. You think I want to do that, bro? Twenty twenty three, man's chilling with them aliens, bro. E T and that. Are you mad, bro? Yeah, I'm good still. I'll save my money, get someone else higher value for my cheddar cheese. I'll be honest. Shout out, um, Krabba. You get me. 
And that is um, some gems that I kind of like. I actually kind of like those gems. Shout out Crabber, man, because you already know I didn't find any of them myself, I'll be honest. So, yeah. Um, you lot, have an amazing day. And, yeah. Uh, damn, I just said it, bro. Yeah, have a good day.